Okay. I'm like my master. No, if you start talking like Squidward, you're gonna swear to God, I'll end this game. Please, no. I'm Welcome gonna back, focus. everybody. To, I'm sorry. Um, hey, that, Thursday that's Night Gaming. Um, today we have a, a new player, Jacob. Hello. He will be other playing. ones abandoned us, except for Omar. Well, well, Nick is well. Nikki is on vacation. Nikki is on vacation, technically. So uh, hiatus. He, he hiatus for 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 a little bit. So he'll he's forgiven. No one else is. But then again, I was never really here. Can't. You can't blame me. I have schoolwork. This is true. School. Remember, kids. School before gaming. Ding. Never. No, seriously, that's the truth. All right, kids. Kids, you only need about. Two hours of sleep to function. Uh, to ask me how I know. No, not that. It wasn't the functioning part. I had to do a lot of stuff after school. I was going through. Pe I was going to people's graduations at the time, and things kind of ran late, so I couldn't make it back to a computer. And no more. Your static is unreal. Your static that's is the, always unreal. That's the. That's possibly the fandom TV. Hold on. <laughs> Turn them all off. <laughs> I'm about to turn it. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, so... so... For the people at home, I'm not wearing pants. I'm wearing shorts. Hello. For people at home, I go swimming Hello. shorts. I am not the temple. Pleased to meet you. Hello. Hello, I am the devil. Pleased to meet you. Now get your shit and leave. Welcome yeah. to Walmart. Get your shit and get out. Alright, now what was I getting? Get your oh. shit and get out! Oh, it's you again. What? Right, I Mike, I swear to fucking God. <laughs> if you I talk like Squidward, I will kick you. How? I wonder how fast you can kick somebody from the Skype. Believe me, I'm in charge. <laughs> I have it right here. <laughs> but you know, that's if you ever go back to talk to him again, you, you're gonna have to hear the voice. Then pick a different voice. Oh, what? Oh, I'm gonna just do the cleaning lady. Just like, he's out for the moment. The cleaning lady. Hello? No, no, Mr. Superman, no here. No, no he, he's not here. Do you Mr. have cleaning supplies? Do you, do you have lemon freshness? <laughs> See, do you have. <laughs> okay, <laughs> now we're playing up the racism. So it's, it's not even gonna be like a normal human, it's gonna be like a clay doll thing. Well, that's not racist at all. That's totally not racist. Anyway, where were we? I can't hey, remember. Wait, 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 Last wait. Thing. Hmm. I need um, my character sheet. It's in the book. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna go beat up some really tiny dude that goes really fast. At some point. Okay, so um, when we last left our heroes, o Omar had. I don't know oh. what Omar did. Omar. Well, did I can't. Let's see. Omar and Last thing I remember, I fell to the ground and I left because I got bored and wanted to go to sleep. Omar busted up some drug dealers with the shield, and then the shield, and then he got bored, so we went home. Um, the shield went, and Mickey wound up um, doing some, some intelligent. Yeah, you know, um, trying to figure out what the hell happened to um, you know all that shit that had gone missing from the. Um, Museum after the uh, after you stopped the bus. Oh wait, that's right. You stopped Baron Blizzard. You rescued Watermaster, which the was Obsidian, mostly me doing it. The Obsidian Blade and the uh, other elements of crime all beat um, Baron Blizzard within an inch of his life. All right, this was the funniest thing. A villain, and I don't know what to really call myself because I'm not exactly a hero. Oh. Basically, stopped a villain and saved the girl. Personally, I tr personally you can't take all the credit. I tried, but I don't think I was of much. By, use. by the time you came there, the plane Every was going down. You you beat you found Mimic Cat, which I think I'm going to call copy. I think I'm calling Copycat for the time oh, being. Uh, also, I think for me it's a hollow victory. But I'm done. <laughs> That was horrible. Hello. Hollow <laughs> baby. Damn you, Mike. Um, hey, he he made ice puns. I make you know suit of armor puns. <laughs> yes, but ice puns are funny. Oh, the side puns. No. 
I actually do I, have a ranged attack that's actually worth doing. I no, ice puns are punny. Very punny. Anyways, can we get to work here? Meanwhile, um you No we can't. You wound up discovering at least the shield wound up discovering um I think that Mickey helped. Mickey and the Shield. Mickey um, and the Shield. The Mickey and the Shield. Da, 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 da. Anyway. One's a superhuman, the other's a derp. <laughs> <laughs> He's kind of like a sidekick for the whole group, if you ever really think about it. Yes. Next time you get PowerPoints, you are pe putting them into sidekick. Well, we all kind of use them, because you use them constantly. I've never really used M Mickey. Holy Christ, James, I love your picture. He's not gone. Really cool. uh, okay, ba back to serious junk. No, my serious junk, I mean my... We're serious? No, seriously, I never used Mickey. Never. Nope. I may ask him a question or two, but I don't use him personally. Well, no. Yeah, anyway. Well, Mike kind of needed a chauffeur, and, well, he's a kind of a co-worker for the S.H.I.E.L.D., so... He's kind hey, of a so what am I? So, what does that, that make me? That guy, that guy... You're, you're, you're that dude. In the corner. With the music. We don't know because why the hell you're here, but you're here. So we just, we let you do your thing, and it kind of works in our favor. So we, <laughs> we just deal with it. My character is a baby. No. No, baby. Well, fine. Mm. Be serious, damn it! <laughs> Somewhere. Okay. We're we are we are. This is a technically serious campaign, except we only take it half serious. Yeah, yeah, you know. Well, I mean, honestly, uh, I after I, after you fuck figure out that the most one of the greatest crime spree ro cr robbery crime sprees of all time was caused by a dude that's like an inch tall, it's hard to take shit seriously after that. That's why I say we have to take things half seriously, or we microscopically take things seriously. I, I'm only taking it three quarters seriously. I'm but you know what? Up. Why so serious? Mildly serious. Let's see now. Um, okay. where were we? Oh yeah, there were super people. I was in the Stop recycling doing bed. That. Okay. I was listening to my Myself music, making some new rhymes. I was in the recycling bin. <laughs> Oh yeah, Mike. It, you, know, you know, after a while, you you get rebuilt. Um, it's been it's been about two or three days since you first kind of all met up, except for Jacob, because Jacob, well, it's Jacob. I suddenly jumped into the scene. Suddenly, a monk appears. What? All right, what am I looking for? I'm like, and I'm like, hey, I just met you, and this is crazy, but I'm a monk. This might seem crazy, but I'm not actually a human. <laughs> okay. Hey, I anyway. just met you. Hey, I just met you, and this is crazy, but I'm a baby. You're not a baby. I know. And I lean over to like she would like maybe I mentally. Can dream. Maybe. I can dream. Devin. Oh God. I, I, like I pick call. up the table and flip it. <laughs> flip I'm Dave death. Strider. Uh, yeah. Take a drink. Yep. Of course. Oh, yeah, um, Jacob. So, so if we get Devin drunk enough, we're, we're going to have easy times with the monsters and whatnot. Oh, just wait until I get 20, turn 21. Oh, yeah, um, Jacob, just to uh, inform you ahead of time, we are doing the Homestuck drinking game. So every time I say my name or make a reference to Homestuck. Or also, if anyone makes a reference to Homestuck, you take a drink. Also, if I ever say insane clown posse or watch out for those juggalos, they're crazy. That's another um, reference, so take a drink. Okay. Wait, anyway, wait, what? Maybe we should actually get started. Jacob will throw you in at some point. Um, maybe quite uh, early. We, we have been known to use teammates as, you know, ammunition. <laughs> when did that happen? Last Last year, remember? I was oh, yeah. to a plane. <laughs> well, that wasn't a teammate. <laughs> well, at that point, he was a teammate. We had a uh, you know a team goal to go save Watermaster, which we succeeded. But how it splatter? Yeah, we did it in the most dangerous manner possible. We sh we threw a guy into a plane, was thrown by another guy, and then you have a third guy. I forgot how I got up there. I think I grabbed you and jumped. Yeah. 
You grabbed everybody in probably some weird perverted way. No, he didn't. He just grabbed. He, he grabbed me by the chest. I picked up a cat and I picked up him and I jumped. And I'm just sitting here. Okay, moving along. Uh, we need another town boy. Anyway, who is that? Guy? We need another town boy. Son of a bitch. We have He's Mickey. He, he didn't die yet. We need He's another. He's not dead one. yet. <laughs> I'm not dead yet. Shut up. I, 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 I am not dead. I can fix him. I can sing. I am not dead yet. I can do the Highland thing. Okay, 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 okay. Or I'll go. Okay, 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 okay. That's four Ks if you were counting. Okay, that's good. That's good. What am I looking for? Here it is. Um, okay, so... Wait, wait, wouldn't that be the Ku Klux Klan killing? A killer? No, I, I, I don't even want to go there. Yeah, yeah, it would. So wouldn't you be kill Like, that would be, like, the person who kills off the Ku Klux Klan. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yes. What am I listening to now? I don't even know. Um, super villains. Right. So there was a... Who is echoing? Does everyone have headphones? Yes. Omar? Yes. yes. Why am I hearing Mike? I have feet phones. Right. Put in damn headphones, please. I have headphones in. I have iPhones. Do you have Get headphones Apple. in your... I also have headphones. Are they plugged into your... They're plugged into my computer. Not into your iPod, but you're using for the... Um... No, I'm not using my iPod. Then why am I hearing echoing? Echo! Nobody right, knows. Everybody quiet for a second. Hello? Everybody quiet for a second. Hey! Echo! What? No echo. Echo? I, I'm not okay, hearing I hear it now. It's coming off of you. It can't be coming off of me. I've got my headphones in. Well, it came off of you for like a second. Impossible! Impossible! Okay. Anyway. Okay, guys. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. I'm not even alive. I will break your character. Mm -hmm. so, I do that regularly, and you yell at me for that. We're level 10, right? I'm just making sure. Yeah. That's yeah. Like Devin, Devin, I do that constantly, and you yell at me for that. Don't yell at me! I can what? So, anyway, wait, where were we? Superheroes, right. Um, the Beyblade. Kinda. Well, I am. I don't know about the rest of you. The rest of you are just some bu a bunch of super powered ass douchebags I hang around with. I'm the karate kid. Call me a douchebag. Oh. I ain't no douchebag. I'm Dave Strider, bitch. <laughs> Fuck you, old man. I'm a douchebag's friend of a douchebag. Name Dick. I know. You know karate. what sucks? Being named, like, one of my friends is named Richard Butler. And one day I just accidentally called him Dick Butler. <laughs> Hey, Dick Butt. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> so, in the Bye. news today... I know. That's not what I thought you were about to say. In the nude... I, you know... All of a sudden, the, 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 the shield like walks the out in nothing but a speed out. Wait, wait, Te repeat that? Technically speaking, I'm always nude. Repeat that last part. I don't even fucking know. Repeat that last part, please. What did you say? I don't know what he means, so let's just skip that. Technically speaking, the shining armor is always nude. Oh, no, I thought he was going to walk out in the studio. <laughs> I'll be there for you soon. I'm going to punch you, Jacob. My cat, my, <laughs> I'm going to push my fist through the internet and punch you. Ow. Oh god, you're gonna put your fist through all the uh porn to hit him. I oh, don't know. You're gonna have to get through my porn shield. <laughs> right. Don't go punch what? someone in the ass. <laughs> oh god, he's gonna fist it. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. No, not my shield. Um can, can I start? So going I've been waiting for you to start for the longest okay. time. I'm just kind of... Hey, All right, let's do that. Hang on, I'm going to restart the opening. 
Okay, and welcome to Thursday Night Gaming. Take two. Jacob, uh, so since we've been derping around for God only knows how long, we're restarting. Now, what's in the news today? Um, let's see, going off the top of my head. Um, I'm going to just take a wild guess and say some random guy in a loincloth with dolls are going crazy. What do you mean? Some voodoo man. Uh, what would make you yeah. say that? <laughs> Half the derping from the last chat. Hello. I Wait, no, no, it it's the chat before the last chat. Oh yeah, because I was like talking. Damn it, I'm making this character. It's gonna be awesome. Just, just assuming. Which <clears throat> really hope he doesn't have mind control. Hello. Why? Because <laughs> that's just gonna suck for him. How come? Because think about it. Who is he gonna mind control first? The biggest person or the smallest person? <laughs> and then wait, wait, Whoa. wait, wait. Who is the biggest person here? You. Actually, and it's probably a tie between me and she between Shield and him. I'm probably bigger than you just because of outwardness, but I'm hollow inside. I'm a child. I'm about five nine. Oh, well, wait, I'm wait, a wait. Young think about this. Wait, wait. Think about this. I am a. You're like a teenager. Jacob, Who is you gonna pick up yeah. first? The guy in somewhat military outfit, the guy in the giant suit of armor. Well, should be a guy in a suit of armor. Well, how about the one that's famous, you know, for having super strength? <laughs> I don't know. He, he could pick all of us, for all I know. Yes. That's, that's anyway, we're, stop metagaming. Where the metagaming alligator will come down and om nom 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 your characters. <laughs> how is he going to eat yeah, my character? Om nom nom my mutants and masterminds, Buck. Think of an alligator eating metal. Uh, anyway, Raffle. in the news today, um, today Ice Master is, Escape, today, or whatever his name is. Today marks the um, about five year anniversary of the red the red the red storm. What was the red storm again? Um, well, actually, this is something that's kind of I'm adding into the continuity. So, um. Would that be considered Lasar's awakening, or is that no? The red storm was a a, a moment in a period a week long about a week long period, or it it's kind of like um you know how in um Static Shock there was the Big Bang, mm -hmm. maybe it's kind of like that. A, effectively, a co a co there was this meteor shower. And guys, hang on, I need another pillow for my chair. My butt's hurting. I'm butt hurt. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. I wonder why. Oh, I'll be right back. Um, and effectively, the red storm was this big meteor shower, and in the aftermath of it, a lot of people gained superpowers, or a lot of people developed superpowers. Well, essentially, this is the this is the mutant gas, and the after effects is that you have ten to twenty bang babies running around with superpowers. Well, except it was more of a worldwide. Like it affected people's like people who would have been who could have had the gen who, like you know for superhumans you need a particular genetic structure if you're getting like superhuman engineering at the moment. So like these um, these people had the when this the red storm occurred a lot of people who were susceptible to the genetics of to gain superpowers developed them. Um, and today marks the five year anniversary since that happened. And a lot of sh and of course, because someone, when it, whenever it's the anniversary of something, someone's got a bitch about it. The, um. Oh god, this is gonna be like some racial dispute about mutants versus humans. Kinda, you'll, you'll see. It's gonna be the Legend of Korra all over again. No, 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 it's gonna be like uh, X Men all over again. The, well, there's, a group core, called the SH, there's a group called the SHC, Superhuman, um, or the SRC, the Superhuman Regulation Committee. It's effectively, um, <sighs> it, it, it's common knowledge, I'm not even rolling because this is history. Um, I'm glad I've been in the radar so long. Uh, it's but kind the, of, um, the, they're kind of, effectively they're just a bunch of, like, this... It it primarily is those Bible thump Bible thumpers, the wealthy middle class and the upper class. Oh goody! So they're gonna look at me going witchcraft, witchcraft. 
it's, wait, wait, no, wait. it's primarily they are they are for the control the um, regulation of superhumans at for the j safety of the populace. Um, the but the obvious under mo underlying motive is they want those superpowers to only belong, you know, the wealthy, you know, they, they view superpowers as like something that could affect the um, course of, you know, finances and things like that. And if they don't have control over that sort of thing, you know, they're more in con regulation of superhumans for the sake of profit, the things that could come from it, bigotry and fear out of, you know, these people are different. So yeah, racism, kind of. Kind of like the X Men, and of course, and Cora, of course, and well, of course, Cora is more like that's something naturally happening in their world, where this is a mutation that's not it's, natural. It's not natural. Some uh, granted, superhumans have been a look at Lasara. He, he's been around for who knows how fuck long. Long enough to cause a major disturbance to fuck up everything for the rest of us. Um, well, it's more of, like, superhumans have been around for the past, um, since, like, the, since, the, since the 80s, superhumans started that surgeons, and then, or, but superhumans, before but then, that you were speaking, beings, yes. of, beings of power have existed in this, un in this world, it's all, effectively our world, except for, um, you know, magic, and, like, beings of power have existed for, throughout time, just not, like, you know, the genetic engineered super soldier, or the, you know, dim or the person from a dim Dimension Z coming through and fighting crime in our world. Those kind of people did not exist. There was a, in this time, until about the 1980s, during the Cold War, when rather than build nuclear weapons, they started we built working... nuclear in, people. We built su they, superhumans and super science were really invested more in. You know, in the space program, so that's why we have a lot more technological development we had today. A lot of things. Hey, can I? Can I have a, a chainsaw? No. Okay. Come on, man. I'll say this much. Is that a gamers two reference? Huh? Please tell me that was a gamers two reference. Uh, I don't know. Okay. Why would you want a chainsaw? Because <laughs> it's a chainsaw. I hate you. I guess it is pretty cool. I'm a martial artist. Weird. Hang on, oh, let I me rev up chainsaw. my chainsaw. No. <laughs> I shoot your character now. In the face. I throw a gauntlet at you. In oh yeah, face. wait. Did, Jake, did you say chainsaw? Oh wait, anyway, anyway, anyway. What was I thinking? Um, hang on. Get Racist on Bible the... beating bastards. Oh yes, and... And as opposed, and standing opposed to them, is like is a is another. I don't have a witty um, acronym acronym for it because I never really thought of the name. But it's effectively led by a a lawyer, like a, you know, it's effectively led by the um, lawyers and other wealthy companies that are kind of pro superhuman and like like it, the Black Rose. Gee, I wonder who might be in charge of that organization behind the scenes. Probably Black Rose, because he's awesome like that. Um, I yeah, want a space he's a shuttle. really heroic supervillain, isn't he? What do you need that for? He's not really... I don't even count him as a villain. Uh, neither do I. He's an anarchist. So I, I kind of look at him going, okay, I don't even give a shit anymore. On the council for it is um, a lawyer, lawyer of the Fair Chauvinon the Third. Uh, or not the third, the um, second, um, and along with a few other wealthy business people, um, you know, mask inter mask industries, uh, which is masquerade, M A S Q U E industry, mask industries, and a few other um, random like, bits and people. Like, uh, masquerade's part of that. Shh, just <laughs> <That's> so <laughs> obvious. <laughs> Hey, at least it's got, at least, um, the Blakeney, the Blakeney Opera House hasn't funded it. Good lord. <laughs> oh, hey, God. <laughs> I want a space shuttle. <laughs> you don't need it. You're not going into space. I'm going to punch you soon, man, in the throat. <laughs> We're going into space right now, damn it. No, we aren't. <laughs> Depends. Does Earthmaster throw me upward? 
I don't even care what we're doing right now. Space. I will now. kick you from this call. We're trying to catch I'm a sorry. thief that stole a lot of items. Hey, hey Jacob. And this you're worried about space. Wait, hey, Jacob, just to remind you, we're recording this to be yeah. on a podcast. Yeah. Just don't be a dick. Oh, okay. Don't, don't at least be a retarded dick. Well, I wasn't being a retarded dick. I was kind of being retarded. Now I'm just being a dick. So you're being a retarded dick? No, I'm not being retarded anymore, though. I'm just being a dick. Um, okay. So, you know, it's like, and you know, so AKA the wealthy soup, uh, and um, the wealthy heroes are the wealthy, facing basically well, Bible thumping hero? assholes. Who said, who said the, I'm not well, well, the wealthy hero, the wealthy superhumans in their alternate identities. Pretty much, it's you know, Sentry, but he's you know whatever his name, his last name is. I'm you know blah blah blah. You know Obsidian Blade. <laughs> Obsidian Blade's awesome. He, I, I don't even care yeah. if he's a villain. He's the, awesome. The Scarlet Pimpernel's funding it from behind the scene. You know, it's effectively the superhuman community, the superhuman community's big middle finger to you know a bunch of Bible thumping assholes. Bible this, thumping hey, dick shit. Um, hey, the much the equal. Okay, going on. Moving along. I'm doing a circular motion with my hands to symbolize we're going on. <laughs> Okay. They see me spin this record right round, baby. Mm -hmm. All right. One of the, um... One of the, um... Heads of the, um, you know, once the superhuman regulation, burr, 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 um, is, is one of the founders, or the found there's they are the found, or two of the founders, um, Lawrence and Michelle Silas, um, who, who, you know, at, shortly after the Red Storm, their mm -hmm. son went missing five years ago, and they're gonna like, oh, you know, superhumans, burr. Wait, wait, is this a lesbian couple? No, Michael and what was her? I heard something else. You said something else. Or so like something in Michelle, you know. Yeah, the Silas family of um, Silas Tech Industries, a big technology firm. Like, they're, it's one of those things where their son went missing, and since it happened around the time of the Red Storm, obviously, superhumans had something to do with it. Clear, clearly. Um, so, how you know, how are superhumans involved with a uh, child missing case? Um, because in a because fuck you. Because pretty much. Because they're bigots and they needed an excuse. Because it couldn't have been like bad parenting or anything like that. No, oh, of course be not. You know, a super wealthy family and like because you know kids and kids with super from super wealthy families are always loved by their parents. You know, they okay, get all the on from, from the world. like daddy never loved me. <laughs> Please enough about, not bring Austin Powers into this shit. But enough about um, backgrounds for characters you haven't met yet. Um, and of course, some of the other firms that, um, you know, it's, it's effectively, we represent the good guys, we, we represent the superpowered, we're just a bunch of assholes. They're yeah. doing their rallying counter rally, they're doing their annual debate. Wait, I just want to, are we like in the middle of this? Um, well... They've at, they kind of at, they want, they don't, they, they kind of just, well, one of the, actually one of the particular debates is, um, the soup, the more recent superhumans, uh, the more recent superhuman projects done by the Californian, the, Cal the, um, army, the, um, military science, military science and police scientists in California, primarily focusing around shield. not only the shield, but the more recent, the more recent project leading leading us straight into our next um, news clip, but also the multi-man, pro the many-man project, which is to occur fairly soon, which would be another another superhuman to be added to the state police force. Um, that's to occur within the next day and a half. Oh, um, it sounds like prototype all over again. S.H.I.E.L.D., um... The shield has been asked to, you know, as kind of a symbolic welcome to the superhuman thing. Shield's been asked to, you know, go as a sort of representative of the state police. 
Um, of course, again, Mickey and Shield are on call to just in case if the riot the riots get out of hand, and you know yet and um, there are a strange series of bank robberies have been occurring lately up and down the Californian coast. Are they like the other ones? Um, these are bank robberies. The other ones were museum robberies. Um, okay. Effectively, people would walk it. Um, they, someone would walk it, you know, they'd go about their day, the next thing they'd know, half the the, into, the vault's been practically cleaned out. You know, I just realized something funny and people have all the superheroes could do. They yeah. could boycott, boycott all their services. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Hell, in, in this world... Boycotting would be more like, just don't do anything and let... In this, in this world, off. actually, in this world, the um, continuity-wise... Superhumans are almost a world power. They're act they're quite literally through the sheer amount of size, populace, and size, and you know, and governing fa and factors of like they've practically got their own stat, their own government. Wait, here's a question: What is uh, Swinger technically still canon in this, or um, Swinger what? is kind of canon? Okay, so he, right now he's probably a wrinkly old guy. Bastard sitting up on a um, spaceship, on, in a space, on his space station with his bear. <laughs> yes. No, 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 it's a new bear. He, he had to get a new one. The old one passed away. <laughs> yeah. Sounds like the best Kentucky redneck I could ever hear. <laughs> he, he has I'm a sorry, base. I just have to say before, it. You know, before America or Russia got to the moon. <laughs> yep. <laughs> He I'll comes out in a little spacesuit, comes out with cookies, and like, hey guys. Oh, Come on awesome. in. nice to meet you. <laughs> Come on in, I was just watching you on the TV, you know. But anyway, um... I want to be a brain in a jar. Oh, my leg. So, you can't be a brain in a jar. I heard oh. that. Okay, uh, okay, come on. Anyway, um, so yeah, those are the two major things, like I said, within the net, very soon, we're probably, unless, we're probably going to do a time skip to the next day, um... Time skip. But, like I said, mysterious bank robberies, uh, oh, and also, there have been rumors that a villain, that a villain known as Voodoo Freak has not been seen in Louisiana for quite some time. This does, this does thing? have the team, the superhero team that works that works out of there, um, known as um, Solaris, consisting of two of the more prominent members being Swiss and Gypsy. Gypsy being the ar the arch enemy of um, Voodoo Freak. Um, it has them a bit concerned since, well, normally you know by this point in time it's a predictable schedule. Okay, oh it's. Oh, it's the second week of the month. So and so is going to come out with their mas with another master plan. And it's like a regular you know, basis. It's like he has his evil villain period. You, you know, it's like it's like by this point, Black Rose and, and Scarlet Pimpernel don't even fight, but very much unless they have to. They go, they meet, they get a cup of coffee. That, that, like, oh, that version of like it. fighting is like, man, I am tired of this fucking desk job. I need to get out of here. Before I hang myself with his khaki tie. Or tacky tie. How do you okay, that's better. <laughs> yeah, I was about to say, how do you Awfully hang yourself specific with tie. khaki tie? Um, so, you know, it, it, it's kind of like, and it's not even like, you know, it's like not even the clockwork thing, because, you know, sometimes everyone goes, fuck that, I need, I might either, they need more time to plan, or they just don't want to commit a crime that t at that point, and they'll just do it whenever the hell they want. You, you, know, you know one thing that would screw with a lot of superheroes that have, like, they time their villains? Just, like, just not skip a week, and then do it on a different day, <laughs> the week after. <laughs> right. Or and, and then go back <laughs> to the regular schedule. Oh, and although, and one of the other things is they've, um, they kind of, you know, just because, you know, supervillain escapes, you know, they go and search a criminal network. The entire Louisiana criminal network has no clue where this guy is. 